Hey, Matt Selhorst, Boat Dealer Profits, where we're committed to helping you sell more boats, make more money, and have more fun. Um, just got the booth set up for Marine Dealer Conference and Expo down here in Orlando. And um, I wanted to talk to you, uh, because I'm going through it right now, wanted to talk to you about taking advantage of opportunities, taking advantage of events, boat shows, offsite events, charity tournaments where you, you bring a boat to the event, whatever it may be, you know, you, you put a lot of effort in. You know, I, I came down from uh, just outside Charlotte, came down to Orlando, um, invested in a, not, a, not much, but uh, a little bit of marketing material because I, I do maybe one show a year um, if, I, if I decide to exhibit here at MDCE. But you know what? You put the investment in, you make the effort, you get the hotel, um, you, you travel, uh, you put together all the material. I mean, if you see behind me, I've got uh, a magazine, um, obviously my book, which hopefully you have a copy of, Boat Dealer Profits, uh, you know, getting your business cards together. I've got DVDs, I've got a drawing. Um, and I wanna talk about what's your strategy. So when you, when you make an investment, when you make a commitment of time, of money, of resources, uh, for me being away from my family, which is, is huge for me, um, you know, you wanna make sure that you, you maximize the opportunity, that you don't just go and, and go through the motions and you know, put your, your most effort in setting up the booth. Um, to me, where the effort is, is most important and most impactful is up front on what's your strategy so I have an approach for lead generation. I have approach to uh, get people to make a, a small commitment. I have approach to get them to move up to a larger investment. And then I've got an approach to follow up with everybody and to maximize the results that they can get with me, okay? So if you, if you invest in the book, guess what? There's a high likelihood that you're gonna get a follow up if you fit my criteria for a dealer I would wanna work with you're gonna get a follow-up invitation to take advantage of, of the next step. If you invest in the, um, take advantage of what I set up as a, an MDCE scholarship, um, if, you, if you take advantage of that scholarship um, and you, you start going through the program, there's gonna be opportunities for you to get more and more deeply involved with our done for you programs and where we become your marketing department. Again, if you're a good fit for that program. But having those having thought through it ahead of time from, okay, what's my strategy? Now, how am I gonna execute it? And then what am I gonna do to maximize it at the end? It's, it's these two end caps that tend to get missed and you focus on the execution of what's the booth gonna look like. Now, I, I focused on it a little bit. I had a banner made and, and um, I had some, some material printed and uh, I, I, I did invest in that stuff, but it was all within the framework of, okay, if this is going to be my lead generation approach, what do I need to do to draw people to the booth? If this is going to be my offer um, for, for people that are even just slightly interested in sales and marketing for their boat business, you know, a, a book that's 20 bucks, what can I do to, to incent them to take advantage of that so that they spent some money with me and they have a, a great feeling and they're like, man, this is some, some good information in here. It's got me motivated. Plus I got the DVD, which is even more educational, uh, which is even, even gonna give them some more specific tactics. And then say, hey, there's a group of people that are coming to the show that already know me, that have been watching my videos, that are reading my boating industry articles, uh, that are listening to the podcast, that have seen me speak, um, have maybe invested in another program, and, and they just haven't invested in the, the newest, the splash system, uh, which is, is something that um, you know they need to do. If, they, if they're serious about improving their, their uh, sales and marketing, it's probably something that they need to do if they fit the criteria. So what can I do for those people? You have the same exact thing at the boat show. You have people that they've never heard of you before um, and they're not gonna be ready to make an investment of any sort. Well, how can you capture their information so you can then follow up with them and be there when they are ready? You have people that um, you know, are, are ready to buy a boat, but they're not sure what they're gonna buy. You, you know, you've already got that nailed down with your sales team. They, they know how to do that pretty well in most cases, um, but are they capturing the information just in case they don't buy? Um, number three, you've got people that already know you. Maybe they've bought a boat from you in the past. Maybe they've been in shopping you and they just haven't pulled the trigger yet, but they have a relationship with you. What can you do 
that's going to incent them to make the decision to get involved with your um, with your dealership to buy one of your boats or to uh, you know join your marina or join your boat club or whatever whatever services you have that that would make sense. What are you going to do to incent them to do that? And for me, you know, is it a, a cash discount? That's one of the worst things you can do um, to just give a discount. So you notice I, I've got a scholarship. I've got a scholarship program that I'm offering. And, and if you're if you're um, interested in that concept, you know, there's some ways you can adjust it. It works well for me because I I educate people, I do things for them, and, and scholarship kind of works. Um, but can you do things to incent them to make a decision today that's not going to be a dollar for dollar cash discount? So, you know, can you offer a, a product? Uh, can you offer a service that maybe is a, a step up that uh, they get just at your event? Think about it in terms of what can you do that's unique and different that nobody else is doing. I, I can assure you that there's nobody else in this whole building that has an MDCE scholarship for their program. I, I can assure you I'm the only one that has that. And um, uh, David Parker just walked by. Um, but uh, it, it's something that I feel is so key to you maximizing. And then I already have a game plan for what's going to happen after the fact. Well. Part of it's just you know normal and customary for me. I've got my uh, my boat dealer profits newsletter. Uh, I have the uh, the podcast. I have my um, email sequence that you can that you can sign up for. Uh, if you haven't signed up for it yet, the uh, 11 ways to sell more boats now and forever. Um, so that gets you on a, an automated email sequence with a bunch of videos that are just awesome that go into more detail from the report. Um, so. If I generate a lead here at uh, at the dealer conference and I, I have a conversation with somebody, even if they just drop a card, next year, if I if I decide to exhibit again, um, if I enjoy the experience and it, it fits well with my business, then guess what? Now I've got a relationship, so when they stop by, they're already at that next level. And if you take that same opportunity with your boat show, and even if somebody just fills out your drawing to to win, you know the the uh, family fun package uh, or whatever you put together for your drawing, you have the opportunity for a full year to follow up with them, hopefully invite them to events to get them into your dealership. And if they don't at that next boat show, guess what? You can invite them to your pre-boat show event before anybody else has the opportunity. Or if they don't show up to that, they come to the boat show again, they've already got a relationship with you. But you have to have that strategy in place. You have to have those mechanisms in place. It just has to be normal and customary for you to do those things, having autoresponders, um, having uh, newsletters and boat previews, uh, and, and doing all the other stuff in the splash system. And that's, uh, it, it's interesting because it's doing this event ha has put that opportunity on me and that challenge on me of, how am I gonna how am I gonna apply the the splash principles which I teach to dealers and I basically have you know done for them they just 80 percent done and 20 percent we got to customize now I've got to come up with it from the ground floor uh, and, and put everything else that I've been doing um, and, and so it just as I as I got the booth set up I'm like I need to do a video with my you know I put all this time in the booth how can I leverage and maximize it well again another opportunity that you have at a show leveraging and maximizing the the work that you did so I could have this nice pretty booth set up with you know my magazine and my book and my banner and my my feather which you can't see over here you know I could just the people that come in that's it but taking this opportunity to take you know, what are we on nine minutes this is a long one sorry about that uh, but hopefully it's, it's it's resonating with you if you're still watching me I took an extra 15 minutes to kind of get it set up get it for a good background and doing a video that's now going to be out there forever. I can send it to my my list of uh, of subscribers to Boat Dealer Profits newsletter. Um, I can send it to people that I meet here at the show, and they're going to get it in a future newsletter. It'll probably be in a, a couple of weeks. Um, I, I kind of collect them up and just do them as it strikes me. But it's one more thing. So what I tell dealers is, you got all your boats set up, and they're they're looking pretty, and you've got them. You know, some of them have. Um, uh, Chaparral and Rabalo, they always put you know one of their boats up on um, you know up on the 45 degree angle so you can see the strakes and see underneath. Um, you know you've done all that work. Why not take the opportunity to do a video of that where you can show the you know all the things that that setup allows you to show whether it's just a, a perfectly staged boat. 
uh, whether it's your newest model, whether it's um, something that you know you're in the water and it's a great a great setup and background and it shows the lifestyle. Just take that little extra time. I know that you're going to be tired. I've been, I've worked the boat show. I I understand that you're exhausted, but guess what? If you put an extra hour of work in, what's that going to do for the results? Um, you know, because it's it's stuff that you can do one time and use it over and over and over. So after, for me, when I was working the boat show, um, everybody would go home and I would get as many boat video walk arounds as I could in before the turned off the lights. You know, the last client left, I'm, you know, we do our wrap up meeting, I'm on my, my camera um, doing the video boat walk arounds because we've got everything staged. We've got, you know, the twin engine that we almost never have in inventory. We've got the uh, 40 foot cruiser that, um, you know, it, it was brought in from our yacht center. We've got this boat, we've got this rep, this uh, manufacturer's rep and, you know, take advantage of everything that you have there and capture it on video because you can then utilize that as well. Man, I really should have made this two videos. I, there was two different trains of thought, but it maximize the opportunity that you have when you put in the work and the investment and the resources to do a show, to do an event, take it to that next level, have a strategy, do what you already do at the event, um, have a follow-up strategy and a, a, a strategy to, to move them up the line from wherever they wherever they, they left at the event and then have a strategy to take advantage of all the work you did to capture it on video so that it, you can use it forever. This video I can pull back out in next year, the following year. Every boat show season I can pull this out and, and, um, and you know the, the, the information is going to be very relevant. I may have more gray hair, I may have less of it, uh, but you know it's going to be very relevant, so it's it's highly leveraged. So there now we're on 15 minutes. Um, thank you very much. If you want to check out the splash system, uh, BoatDealerProfits.com. Uh, if you go there, that free report, uh, 11 ways to sell more boat now and forever, uh, is now uh, is now up on the site. You can get that if you haven't got a copy of my book. Uh, Boat Dealer Profits, right there it is. Uh, you can pick up that BoatDealerProfitsBook.com with the special offer I have going. Uh, if you want to learn more about the splash system, you say, you know what, Matt, I've been watching you long enough. It's time that I, I take advantage of really getting into the nitty gritty and really getting stuff done um, with your system and using your tools and your templates and, um, and and making sure that it gets implemented in our dealership. Uh, you know, reach out to me. Go to boatdealerprofits.com slash apply, and uh, you can check that out. Or go to um, uh, take advantage of a one-on-one -on -one strategy session with me. If you go to the if you go to the blog or, or basically anywhere on my site, on the right-hand column, somewhere in there. It says one-on-one -on -one strategy session with Matt. Take advantage of that. And let's get on the phone and have a conversation about your business, um, where there's opportunities and um, where there's weaknesses, and, and see if maybe the splash system or, or something else that we do, our Done For You marketing program, is a good fit and um, you know would enjoy that opportunity to actually have a, a, a not a face-to-face, -face, unless we do a video chat, which I'm, I'm doing more and more of, uh, but have an opportunity to have those conversations. So thank you very much. Uh, we'll talk to you soon. Matt Sellhorst, Boat Dealer Profits, creator of the Splash System, and I'm committed to helping you sell more boats, make more money, and have more fun. Take care, everybody.